Lately been receiving some review requests. So I would like people to know what I am interested in reviewing. Anything related to a vlogging camera to where an iPhone lens would be great. A stabilizer would be great to review. Things that I don't want to review are makeup brushes and watches. I, I don't wear a watch and it's just not my preference. So I'm not going to be using a watch. So I don't want to get into a gimmick of I'll buy your watch at a discount and then I'll then sell that code to other people so that they can get that watch. Often as far as makeup brushes go. Oh, just uh, trying out a couple things, you know. So the things that I want to review are uh, vlogging related or lifting related, but they have some value. Those are the things that I'm interested in reviewing. So Lifting family, welcome back. So this video review is going to be on the new flavor from Quest Nutrition. It is the birthday cake flavor. I am checking in here from Exercise Express USA in Saginaw, Michigan. As far as the protein bar goes, I have been amped about this one. I have been really looking forward to it, especially since there's another birthday cake flavor that's out there that from a different company. First time I tried that bar, it was just, it was amazing. It since kind of like not worn off a little bit, but at the same time, like my love for it has tamed down a decent bit. As far as this bar goes, we have a 60 gram bar is five grams of fat, 25 grams of carbohydrates, 14 grams of that is fiber, and then 21 grams from protein. Overall, solid bar. I mean, based on the other bars from the Quest lineup, I mean, I, I've seen like the lemon bar was five grams of fat, though the lemon bar flavor was... <sighs> discounted. This flavor I am looking forward to, so let's dive into this one. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother... So as you saw, kind of did the nice slow-mo of the bar and I mean overall as far as the uh, the, the inside of the bar here, um, try to get a little bite of the inside of the bar, kind of like that if you've had their form of fiber, it, it has that kind of gooey, uh, almost taffy-like uh, texture to it to where it's a little bit gummy. Uh, and as far as the, the outer coating on the bar, I'm sure a high def photo of that would look fantastic, but I mean, let's get into the bar. So the flavor doesn't really like jump out at you. It's not super sweet. Doesn't really like jump out at you. There's not a lot of flavor going on here. So as far as the other birthday cake flavored bar that's on the market right now, I, I don't know if there's, well, there are multiple ones. These two companies seem to be competing with the fiber aspect of the market. So I just kind of leave that there. Again, I don't want to, I don't want to try to have this as a comparison video, but there's a lot more flavor with that one. Uh, so if you are looking to back off from some of the sweetness from that bar, the Quest Bar would be ideal for you. I am a sweets person, so while I'm definitely gonna finish this bar because I paid for it, I would not buy it again. But I've also found that, unfortunately for me, outside of like the cookie dough bar from Quest, I have moved on to other bars. Because of the nutrition profile on this bar, I'm gonna rate this as a three out of five stars. If you do want to back off from some of the sweetness from the other bar that's out there that has a decent bit of fiber in it, 
you will enjoy this bar. It's just that for me, the sweetness needs to come up a little bit. Thanks for watching. Thank you for your support. Remember to click that like button, smash that thumbs up, turn on notifications. Please remember to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and as always, keep pushing.